Okay, let's head to the next town so we can go get the blue fucking crystal of Tranquility or whatever, I don't know. <laughs> Dracula, I'm so pissed at you, yeah, I'm gonna kill your brass. <laughs> whip, yeah, whip, yeah, Dracula, gonna fuck you up with my super whip. Um, everybody should listen to Brental Flaws rendition of, um, Bloody Tears. It actually is pretty good. Who's that? He's a guy who sings video game music. It's pretty cool. I guess not really. Oh, I'm dead. Oh no, did we get a game over? No, I still have three lives. Oh. Well, now I have two now. Yeah, Nick, learn how to count. Jesus. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice. I um, like how they're, like, really, like, what a spider web looks like if you draw it, throwing them at you. It's not like Spider-Man's web where it's a ball. Spider-Man lives in the ball. When Spider-Man throws his web, it comes out as like a stupid little ball and then hits a wall and turns into like a real web. Web long. Web swing. Those bats are stupid. What a horrible night to have a curse. Fuck this thing. Why does it do that? Because it's... Oh, well, because they wanted to have a day and night system. Which, in concept, is a good idea. But like, if you do it wrong, it's, it's a bad idea. No, it's just executed badly. Yeah, and uh, oh, obviously if you do it wrong, it's a bad idea. Yeah. But I mean, like, did they have to tell you? I mean, they could tell you like one or two times, that'd be fine, but not every single time. It's retarded. Yeah, no. And then the cutscene is really stupid, too. <laughs> dude, 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 we gotta head to the next town so we can explore the town and blah. But now you can't because it's night. Yeah, I know. I can still get over there, though. Oh, yeah, I know, but. That is really stupid. You should be able to break into people's houses like in real life. You got this. Hearts galore, we. <laughs> Do hearts disappear? No. Well, if I lose all my lives, yeah. No, I mean like when you drop, when you kill them, they drop it. Do they disappear? Um. Wait. What? When they drop it, yeah, they disappear if you don't catch it in time. Um. Wrong way. <sighs> and it's morning, and we're now we're in the town now. Hey, let's, if I didn't edit out by that time. Nicely done. Now let's explore the town, see what goodies I can find. Like. If there is any good goodies here. Oh, yep. Holy water that. Climb down the fucking stairs. <laughs> do, do, do. We're in a town. We're collecting shit. Is that oh, it's like there's nobody here? there. How the hell did this guy get out of his home? He had holy water. Hello. Dracula's eyeball reflects the curse. Oh, no, it doesn't. You lie to me. It really doesn't. What is it? What is that? He's talking about an, uh, one of the Dracula's pieces as an ability. It's a lie. That was a person? Yeah. I thought it was like a bag. I really didn't know that was a person. Let's, let's go. Next door, ho. <laughs> go, go, go. Hello. Buy some garlic? It has special powers. Well, we do need to actually buy some garlic, but I thought that guy was going to sell it to me. I guess the <laughs> fucker didn't want to. That's stupid. Let's go into this door. Maybe this guy has garlic. Or that guy. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> buy some garlic. Ah. Ah. Another door to go. Buy some shit. You know where you like Simon Strut? Look at that. This is a strut of strength pimping. <laughs> the way he walks. Buy some of my Laurels. Laurels is basically like invincibility stuff, but I don't. They're, they're probably I only have 100 hearts. I don't want to spend that. True. Laurels, it just makes you go invincible. I think I just said that. Yeah. But the only time I'll use a Laurel is when we actually fight Dracula himself, because I want to cheese him so bad. Cheese him? Yeah. Oh, because they're the invincible. I was like, what the hell are you talking about? Hey, Mr. Man, are you selling anything to me? Clues of a boo. 
So they all know that Jackula is dead and you're trying to revive him? Yep. They don't care. Some people do hate me, though. Hello, Ral. The dead river, blah, 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 blah. To the river. Oh, hello, Mr. Man. I'd like to exchange a white crystal for a blue one. Yes, now we got the blue crystal. That's actually pretty cool. So we can go use the blue crystal for blue crystal stuff. Like what? Um. Um. There's not a church in here, shit. Um. But uh, you'll see what I use the blue crystal for. Let's see if I can actually find. Is there any other shops in here? I think that was one of the very beginning where you came in. I I think we went to that door though. So let's keep heading. Right? No, not right. We had to go back to where I said fuck. I think I said that a lot of times though. <laughs> um. It's when we hit to that dead end. That's the spot we need to get back to. That's the next area we need to get to. Right. So we'll edit in when we actually get to that spot. <sighs> oh, God. This game really sucks. Let's, uh... Let's use that garlic. Does okay. garlic raise crystal? I mean, uh... Hello. Okay, you need to drop the garlic here to get this Mr. Man, and he'd be like, I'll give you this silver knife to save your neck. Yay, woo, we got the silver knife, but I'm not gonna use it. What does it do? It's a weapon. Like, yeah. Can you use it unlimited times? But it costs hearts. So, unless you wanted to waste your currency, it's not recommended. I wouldn't use it. it looks stupid. Add it back in. Alright, um, after you get the blue crystal, you have to come back here. And then use the blue crystal. Yeah, I gotta equip the blue crystal. Hold down. Nobody tells you how to do this. Nobody tells you how to do this. So, if you don't know how to do it, you're screwed. Unless you had Nintendo power during that time, you're screwed. Oh, but yeah, I'm pretty sure everybody had Nintendo power. And here's the next match and woohoo, yeah, whatever. Or dungeon. Wait. Okay, I read the map. Just keep heading this way. Ignore everything. Ignore those super spooky stairs up there. They don't mean shit. So, just keep going to the right. Hold on. Yeah, I've been still recording. Okay, yeah, I'm going the right way. Cool. Yeah. Nice. Head and right. What? Why did he jump back? Because he knew I was Simon. <laughs> and you were on a quest. The relinquished this curse is pressed upon me and you and me. Actual me and, and Cody. Because <laughs> this thing is fucking. What the hell is that? Yeah, it's a platform. Right? Oh, I thought that was like a snowman monster of devilness. Okay, here's the lady so we can go um, get the steak. You gotta get another- Oh, you have to get a stake every time you try to find a body part? Yeah. That sucks. Now we gotta go, go, process, whatever the next part is. Nice. Wait, what are you doing? This oh. Way. We gotta go up here. The darkness, beware the darkness. Be fearful, cause do you need the Why do the skeletons always change color? So it can make it look like it's actually different, but it's really not. Um. Beware of Is that blood on the wall? Nope, it's just the color palette. You can believe there's blood on the walls, but seriously, everything looks the fucking same. It's just different colors. Fuck you, man. <laughs> From fucking Simon. Don't fuck with me. Because he's on a quest. <laughs> Are you gonna keep saying that? <laughs> Are you gonna keep saying he's Simon? Cause he's Simon. Then he's on a quest. To relinquish his curse. <laughs> and save the town. No, 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 fuck the town. <laughs> Actually, the town going towards Dracula's lair. Yeah, seriously, fuck those guys. Those guys are jerks. What do they do? Kill you? They are like, fuck you for trying to kill Dracula. What? <laughs> <laughs> but it's Dracula, he's bad. Oh, we're almost there. Almost there. Almost there. 
Whee. I thought you were gonna fall and die. Hopefully. Hopefully. There's nothing here. Okay, cool. Here's the next thing! Were you expecting a boss? Don't! <laughs> we... You now processes Dracula's <laughs> heart! <laughs> it says that for every single time you get one? Yes. Let's uh, see what it does. His heart didn't do anything. Um, actually, the heart actually do something. You gotta get, show it to a fairy man so he can take you somewhere else. But, whatever. Now we gotta exit out of this dungeon. Okay, this is, um, the, when I went to go check the map, the, um, the audacity froze, so we had to, um, post-commentate just the mansion, so, this is more post-commentary. Yeah, and now we know where to go, so, should be quick. Well, we know where to go, but doesn't mean, well, yeah, past Nick does know, too. Yeah. <laughs> So, um, this dungeon actually has a boss in it. Mansion, dungeon, castle, whatever, venue. <laughs> so, um, yeah, this one has a special boss in it. It's probably one of the hardest bosses of the original Castlevania. Probably. He is. Oh, wrong way, Nick. Stupid. I think I complained about how in every mansion all the characters are the same, just different colors. Yep. <sighs> you might actually die. Who cares? And really, really, who cares? Um, we already finished this game. Yeah. Yeah. By this time, we're post commentary. We that we've been done with the game for um like two days ago. Yeah. Just trying to. If you want to know when are we recording this, I could say we've been playing another special game that's been very speedy and blue. <laughs> and Nick's favorite ever. Dun, dun, dun. Mario, what? <laughs> <laughs> um, speaking of Mario, um, Sonic Lost World, um, I want to talk about my experience getting the game. So I was at GameStop to go pick up my reserve copy because I wanted the Deadly Six Edition, so I won't miss out. Yeah. So I went to the guy like, like I want, I'm here to reserve Lost Sonic Lost. I get my reserve copy of Sonic Lost. Where it's like, before I even said anything, he's like, "Hey man, you're gonna go pre-order the Call of Duty or Assassin's Creed, Ass Creed, Call of Duty, or um, <laughs> Battle Fail, Battle Fail. Yeah, that's, yeah. That's, that's a good name to give it. <laughs> I have no preferences against those games. I'm just giving names because I was very unhappy when I was there. But um, so I was like. I'm here to pick up Sonic Lost World. And he gave me the most confused look in his face. He's like, <laughs> what? What is that game? He's like, Sonic Lost World? Is it supposed to be out today? Yeah, it's supposed to be out today. You <laughs> <laughs> so then he's like, what system was this for? Oh, God. <laughs> Wii U. Oh. Then he looks to the right. Oh, there's a bunch of Sonic Lost Worlds right there. <laughs> yeah, they were like all over on the wall. And he's like, it's supposed to be out today? What? So I was like, okay, sure, whatever. I'm, all, I'm just, I'm just putting a smile face, trying to hit, hide my anger, cause like, I, I, it's not worth the yell at this guy. He completely forgot what Sonic was. Like, I need to consume my power level on this guy. <laughs> so then, so then he's like, okay, cause I pre-order it, so I'm gonna get DLC for it. So he's like, okay, you got, just go home, put down this code for the, the, the San, it. Uma Chao. And I was like, add the correct one with. It's Uma Chao. Just, just, just give me my code and so I can go. <laughs> That's funny. Everybody forgot about Sonic. Mm. I bet you people watching this are like, Sonic came out with a new game? What? <laughs> <laughs> Since when? I think the internet people would know. It's just normal people. <laughs> I didn't know there was a new game until we went and pre ordered it. I mean, picked it up. Don't say that, you liar. I've been, <laughs> I've been talking about it like for the past month. But I, that's all. I would never have known if I didn't know you. 
Because there, no, there was no commercials for it or anything. Well, not commercials, but online, yes. But that's it, just online. Um, Sonic Generations had commercials. Oh like, my god. Yeah, because uh, Generations was good. Okay, here's the boss. It's Death! Oh no! That is gonna be a really challenging boss! Oh wait, never mind. <laughs> and that's it! He's over! Yeah! Yeah, we beat the dungeon yep. mansion cave. Yeah, if you actually fight Death, he, um, you're killing him, you'll get a golden knife. Which is not useless. You now processes Dracula's eyeball. Good work. What does it do? I don't know. I don't care. Let's just go. It doesn't do anything except let you look at something. Come on, Nick. Let's go. If you're trying to demonstrate what the eyeball does, but it doesn't do anything. Yep. My least favorite thing about after beating a dungeon, you have to walk back all the way through it. Yeah, but that's, that's the power of editing, for the viewer's sake. True. Why am I standing there? <laughs> I don't know. What's going on? I probably was saying something, like explaining something, but whatever. Come on, Simon, let's get going. I don't wanna. <laughs> I like this place. But Simon, you're on a quest. To save the town. Mr. Krabs, to relinquish his curse. I keep getting that all wrong. I keep forgetting the curse part. Yeah. Simon, go! No! Simon says go! <laughs> well, Simon says I don't wanna go! Oh, wait. Simon, Simon's starting to get some life in him. Come <laughs> on, Simon! <laughs> Simon, go! No! Get out of the cave! Thank God. Hey, Simon, wanna hang out? Not now, Def, I'm busy. Oh, okay. <laughs> get out of here, bats. We're busy. The bats are more challenging than Death. Yeah. Okay, I think by the time this is over, we'll probably be editing out by the when we get out of the uh, mansion, so edit.